lot of work. Y'all yeah. deserve dessert, honey. We definitely do. We can all get hamburgers. It's a lot of We burned a lot of calories just now. So did y'all like the laser tag? Did you like the activity? <laughs> I liked it. I had that double trigger on the whole time, and I was just spraying all y'all. <laughs> it was very uh, Al Pacino. You know, <laughs> Al Pacino. Well, on to other things, honey. The reason I brought y'all here is because this is one of my little favorite spots, and my children have the birthday party here. But I'm having a camp in Michigan for the children that suffered from the Flint water crisis. I want to have a fundraiser, and I thought that a great idea would be a pop-up shop where we can all <laughs> sell our wares and do something for charity. I think it's an excellent idea. Uh -huh. This would be good. Lena, I know you've got your boutique so you can sell clothes. Mm -hmm. And Sheree, we know, honey, you'll sell a good picture. I'll do that and some T-shirts. The reason it's taken Sheree over five years to build Chateau Charade is that she's been banking on the sales of Who Gonna Check Me Boo t-shirts. Yes, honey, Who Gonna Check Your Boo? Uh, <laughs> nobody. <laughs> and of course, Kenya, I know you've got your hair care line. Yes. Okay, so bring it. Because we know if the people don't want it, honey, they say it's good for the pets. So, honey, we gonna... <laughs> Then you'll be using it on your hair? Yes, yes. <laughs> I didn't know that was good for the pets. You know, I got Max. I need to get some for Max. Please bring your bedroom candy. I know you've got enough to serve all the people. Yeah, had to. <laughs> yeah, up that trunk. OK, so we're going to sell penis for the kids? OK. And go naked hair, honey. Yes. Every texture, all every right. length. All right. So now, I want everybody to get along. Miss Kenya? Yes, ma'am. Will you be able to uh, coexist with Sheree? I'm good. But, you know, on the ride here, no. Mallory was basically telling me Sheree had a lot to say, and that bitch called me a bitch, and then she called me a hoe. Bitch, you're the biggest hoe in Hollywood. You didn't did everybody in Hollywood. I kind of just like About left that. it at the uh, mystery game. How'd you leave it, girl? You ran out. I you walked said, out. Nobody ran out. You power walked out. Uh, <laughs> well, I do power walk. The conversation was the over conversation after I read you. A uh, hoe, and after you do it. After I read you, the conversation oh, did you read was, me, girl? was over. I'm hungry, girl. I'm hungry. What are y'all doing? Did you read me? We're sitting here trying to talk. I'm sorry. <laughs> you read me? I mean, now, come on. They were irritating me with all the... <laughs> so, yes, I was eating. It makes me feel better. You call me a hoe. Yeah, let, let me talk about that. When everybody knows that you've been the biggest hoe. Uh, oh, and everybody knows. Oh, Sheree, don't try to hit me knows. with some low blows. <laughs> Kenya gives a whole new meaning to the Dirty South. Poor thing, poor thing. It don't make no sense you give up all that damn twice. Ain't nothing that ever happened with it. Can't hit you below Everyone the belt. Knows you're trying not to hit you below the belt. Let no, me have what you're let doing you understand is over talking this. me, bitch. Okay. All right. Okay. This is not why we're here. Today we are here for a purpose so that we won't be always the, the petty crew. Let's talk about the charity, bitch. You're the one you're throwing me. names. You I didn't, me did I call her bitch at this you table? Call me, bitch. You called me a bitch, no, so now you got a problem with me no, calling you a bitch. I didn't actually call you a bitch. No bitch is going to okay, tell me bitch. to put it's trim around my house. house. What did you just say? You heard what I said. OK, well, repeat it, what? bitch. Listen, you know Trey, this is what I know. Do you know me to be a hoe? When it comes to the whole topic, I feel like everybody should just, just be quiet. Because everybody's had a little hoe moment. I've never thrown a personal dig at you. You've been a hoe, you've been a Y'all all been some hoes. Get your house finished and then throw some stones. Get yours finished, bitch. How about you worry about Chateau More work needed. Needed. I can put four of your homes in my house. You're going to talk to me. At least take your medication first, OK? You still wearing them contacts, girl? I guess 7,200 square feet is really 7, small 7,200 where? Days. Bitch, where? That was B-I-H. Bitch, where? <laughs> You look stupid. No, you look stupid. You look, okay. you really look stupid. stupid. Just like that tire you? Mama Joyce wig you're wearing. It's real old and tired. Oh, it's real old and tired. Okay. She's not going to go there. Come on, your mama. Come on, your wig. Don't have your fat hand in my mother. Hey, hey, you can't be calm down. That's what you're not going to do. You're not going to be calm down. I'm going to your hair. That's it. Oh, okay. Bitch. There ain't got time for y'all. Okay. Ladies. Ladies. Can you? Yes, ma'am. Now, we are talking about a charity event. Yes, let's focus so on charity. To help children, to make our community better. I'm, I'm actually very yes. happy that you chose Flint, not be there with bells on. 
thank you. I'm a Michigander. And if there is something to help benefit these kids that have been affected by the Flint water crisis, you don't have to ask me twice. We have to move past the petty stuff. Got and so whether you got a big house, little house, nobody cares. The big picture is right. we have to do something for our community. I'll do whatever you need me to do. Ms. Sheree, I need you to come. I can care less about her house. And I am all there, and we can definitely coexist. 